a very warm welcome to the informative world and in our in this part we are going to discuss about absolute value and additive inverse let's begin with absolute value absolute value of an integer is the distance of it from zero that means an absolute value of a particular integer indicates its distance from zero okay you know why these brackets are put like this in absolute values this is because these brackets we read this as suppose it is given a uh, uh, three bracket three bracket so this indicates this is read as absolute value of three yes we read this as absolute value of three so it is read as absolute value of three suppose uh, it is given like this bracket minus three bracket so we are going to read is read this as absolute value of minus three so this is the purpose of the bracket okay now if i say that tell me the absolute value of minus three okay the, uh, always remember that we read this as absolute value of minus three oh now so if i ask you tell me the absolute value of minus 3 so you so you will say that absolute value of minus 3 is is equals to 3 what happens here the sign which is put in front of the integer gets removed and then comes the absolute value okay in absolute value we remove the sign which is put in front of the integer it is given absolute value of 5 so what will be the uh, its absolute value no sign is there that means it's a positive number so it will be 5 only okay so what happens in absolute value the sign is removed okay the sign is removed okay the sign in which is put in front of the number is removed okay now let's uh, solve some questions okay absolute value of min minus 7 so as i as i said that the sign is removed so it will be 7 36 is a positive number so it will remain 36 only Minus one hundred and five, so the sign gets removed. Remains one hundred and five. Sign is removed again. Sixty-seven thousand eight hundred ninety. Okay, then it's a positive number, so it will be written as it is. Sixty-seven thousand, uh, sixty-seven thousand five hundred and forty-three. So. in positive number always remember a plus sign is there but if we can also write it normally hai na it does not matter it does not change but in case of a negative number we remove the sign okay and in case of a positive number most uh, uh, most questions will come like this like 543 without a sign so we are going to copy them down as it is okay and in case of a negative number what we are going to do we are going to remove the sign and we then we are going to copy down the remaining number okay now let's come to additive at inverse now in absolute value in absolute value the sign gets removed completely removed and then we write down the number after removing the sign as it is the number does not change you know we uh, just remove the sign and we write down the number in additive inverse what happens see additive inverse is the opposite of the given integer so opposite hai na so suppose it is given minus 79 so what am i going to do if it is given minus 79 so what am i going to do i'm going to change the sign plus 79 hai na so plus 79 is the opposite of Minus seventy nine. So in additive inverse, what happens? The sign is changed. Okay, we change the sign. We change the sign. We convert the sign to the opposite one. Like if it is minus, it will become plus. If it is plus, then it will become minus. है ना? This happens. The number does not change. The sign changes. 
Okay, so now let's solve some questions related to them. Okay, integer questions. Here are the questions of additive inverse. What happens in additive inverse? The sign is changed to the opposite one. Minus here, so it will become plus. So plus 67. 89, it's a plus. So it will become minus 89. Minus 8, 8907, so it will become plus 8907. Seven. It's plus 678. It will become minus 678. It is plus 546. It will become minus 546. Additive inverse of minus 3099 will be plus 3099. And additive inverse of plus 5678 will be minus 5678. So what happens here? The sign is changed. We change the sign to the opposite one. Hena? And what happens in uh, uh, absolute value? In absolute value, we remove the sign and copy down the number as it is. In additive inverse, the sign is changed to the opposite sign. And in absolute value, the sign is removed. So I hope this much is clear. For such informative videos, keep watching the informative one. Thank you.